Hello, so welcome to the series. Uh, I just finished filming 21 videos and I plan on making more as well. It's going to take me a while to upload them, but I figured I'd just show uh, what we've accomplished 21 videos in to give you a little look into what this video series on SFML, C++, game design is all about. So the first thing that we actually did was we learned a little bit about SFML in the first few videos. We then made it so that our sprite can move in all directions um, with the arrow keys and we created a sprite animation. And you can use this with any sprite you want, we just randomly picked one off the internet. Then we did the same thing but for the enemy and gave it basic artificial intelligence. Uh, we then gave our um, little sprite player uh, projectile. And then we made it so that there's collisions um, with the enemy. And we implemented uh, power-ups, so a special attack. We have our HP at the top, our total gill. We created destructible objects. And we created it so that uh, coins can drop. There's a percentage chance that different items can drop. We created walls, so things that we can't walk through. Uh, we created sort of wall modules that we can customize very easily. Uh, we can pick up the gill. Uh, if we got more gill, we could actually go to the shop and buy a weapon, because uh, we made a uh, weapon shop over there. And it could have as many uh, items as you want and stuff in it. So we're just going to try and get the other power up. Um, it's sort of a Nova attack. So this is where the game sort of is right now. Um, we haven't really polished anything. There's no uh, good sprites, but uh, the core dynamics of the game are there already. So we're just going to go into that shop and we have 30 gil at the top left of the screen and we're gonna buy this uh, power up and now we have a Nova attack and we can't buy this one because we don't have 15 gil right now so that's pretty much it and uh, I just wanted to show where we're headed and uh, the next video is about installing on Xcode for Mac but you can follow this series and install on your Windows or Linux, just go to sfml-dev, um, then click uh, learn-dev.org, go to tutorials, and then go to getting started, and then you can install on Visual Studio for PC, CodeBlocks, um, Linux, Xcode, uh, you can also compile for your IDE using CMake, and so don't worry if you're on PC because I will be uploading all the uh, .cpp files and the header files and the images with the more advanced lessons. So you can just follow in whatever thing you're using, but because I'm on Mac, I will be showing how to do the installation of the template on Mac, but don't worry about it. Just uh, take the files that I'm providing. So I'll see you in the next video, and subscribe if you want to catch these videos as they're being uploaded and uh, give it a thumbs up if you learn anything.